Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel Civil Engineering by Stravan and welcome to Stat Pro Tips and Tricks video number 20. In this video, I will explain you complete addition of earthquake load in load case details by using Strat Pro V8i software. So if you are not yet subscribed to our channel, please click on subscribe button and click on bell icon for more interesting updates on civil engineering topics. So in my previous videos, I was already explained how to add the seismic loading condition system according to the different zone categories by using Strat Pro V8i software. Now we can see this is the parameters I was defined in the previous video. So now we have to add the load case details. For that, we have to click on the load case details option. Initially, we need to click on add button here. So we have to select the load case type according to your seismic loading condition. Just I'm giving the title here as earthquake load, which is existing plus X direction. Click on add option. Again, I'm selecting earthquake load in minus X direction. Click on add option. Again, I'm selecting earthquake load in plus Z direction. Click on add option. Again, I'm selecting earthquake load, which is in minus Z direction. Click on add option, close option. Now I'm selecting earthquake load, which is exist in X direction click on add so we will select the seismic loading condition here and direction will be of x with the factor is 1 click on add option again we will close and earthquake load in minus x direction i am selecting click on add option again i am selecting seismic load which is exist in x direction condition with the factor is minus 1 click on add again i am selecting earthquake load which is exist in z direction condition select seismic loading condition according to the z direction factor 1 Lastly, I am selecting the earthquake load which is in minus y minus z direction. Select seismic load which is exist in z with the factor as minus 1. Click on add option. So in this way, you can add the load cases which is related to seismic load in plus x direction, seismic load in minus x direction, seismic load in z direction as well as seismic load in minus z direction by using StatProv8A software. Thank you for watching this video. We will see in the next class with another tip.